Hi friends and welcome to Starry Hilder's Off Grid Homestead. Today we are going to be talking about solar batteries and this is this is a big one if you should buy them used. Now I'm going to say this because this is really important. <laughs> Keep this in the back of your mind. The heart of your system when you go off grid is your batteries. It's not the solar panels, it's not the inverter, it really is the batteries because this is where your amp hours are going to be stored. So these babies really need to be cared for. And that comes down to proper maintenance and really knowing your system. So when you go to somebody's house and say you're on Craigslist and they've got some L16s or they've got some Trojans for sale, I mean, you're like really pumped up and you go over there and they look really good. They look almost brand new. And the guy said, yeah, you know, they were maybe lightly used or they're only three, four years old. They've got a lot of life left in them because, you know, uh, we've done research and a good solar battery should last 10 plus years, right? Okay, don't do it. Do not do it. This is the heart of your system, and you have no clue how these batteries really were cared for. Do you know how often they were maybe discharged below the discharge rate? Do you know how often they were equalized? Do you know if he was hard on the batteries during the winter? Um, if he used a generator to um, charge them up and how often? Not that it's going to ruin that, but you know, do you really know? No, you don't know. The battery on the outward appearance is not going to tell you. Even looking in, uh, inside and taking off the, the caps to look inside the lead plates, you can't tell. You know, hopefully they're going to have water in them. That's the first thing you should look at and make sure that all the plates are covered properly with the distilled water. But you don't know where you're even starting from. And what you, you, know, you can take a refractometer and, and check the specific gravity, but do you know if that person was checking the specific gravity every time he maintained those batteries, which hopefully was a lot? You know, every couple months checking the specific gravity, making sure things are equalized, changing the parameters on his solar charger, his, you know, when, when it was summer, and then changing it again during the winter. There's a lot of stuff. And I don't want to overwhelm you, but I'm telling you all of this because you should never, ever, ever, ever buy a used solar battery. Uh, it's just, especially if you're new, if you're a newbie, don't go down that road. If you're going to invest in solar, invest in solar. Buy some new batteries. Buy some new batteries and start fresh. And know your batteries. Because these batteries can last you 10 plus years. But it's going to be up to you and how you treat them and how you use them. So that is a Starry 101 tip. No to buying used batteries. I don't care how good a deal it is. All right. Until next time, God bless and keep coming back for more.